Howdy y'all, Mr. Kazi coming to you from beautiful Atascacita, Texas. And today I'm going to talk to you about Finding X. And that's Element X. And it's just a chemistry puzzle using some of the knowledge that you've uh, acquired. So, the problem states an Element X forms the following compounds when it reacts with hydrogen, oxygen, and chlorine. Let's uh, A, find the charge of element X, and then consider B, is element X a metal or a nonmetal? First, the charge. And let's start with the chloride. And uh, that's going to break up into element X and chlorine. And we know chlorine has a negative uh, one charge. And there are four chlorines there, so it's going to be a negative four charge. That means X is going to have to have a positive 4 charge. And now, according to our calculations here, um, if X is a positive 4 charge, it will balance. Now let's check the oxide. That will break up into element X and oxygen. Oxygen has a negative 2 charge. And there's two of those. So 2 times negative 2, again, is negative 4, which will give us a positive 4 for X. So it looks pretty overwhelming that X is going to have a 4 plus charge. Now, the question is, is it a metal or a non-metal? Well, hydrogen here is combined with X, and hydrogen is the anion. And if hydrogen is an anion, that means it is combining or bonding with a metal. Therefore, element X is a metal. So there you have it. Element X is a metal and it has a four plus charge or a four positive charge. All right. Thanks for watching and take some time to give me a thumbs up, please, if you liked it. And don't forget to check out my videos. There are about a hundred of them. And don't forget, most of all, to subscribe. Thanks a lot and happy eyes, y'all.